Dependability isn't a piece of hardware, it's peace of mind. It's the confidence you get from knowing that every time you get behind the wheel, you're in a vehicle that's capable and reliable. Dependability isn't driving just any brand. It's driving the number one most dependable mass market brand three years in a row by J.D. Power. It's time for Wild Breakaway presented by Luther Kia of Bloomington. Alongside Mark Parrish, I'm Audra Martin. Another huge win tonight for Minnesota in front of the home crowd. That's six straight wins in St. Paul. A big one, considering they were taking on Boston. We knew this team was going to be anxious for a little bit of payback, but after a little bit of a slow start, the rest of the way out, all Minnesota, two big points. A little payback, and to find a win, those Boston Bruins, and you know what, the Minnesota Wild came out, and they just played Minnesota Wild hockey. It was smart, consistent, solid hockey all the way through. We got to see Goligoski making beautiful passes to Kirill Kaprizov like this. Kirill Kaprizov is starting to catch fire. The rest of the team, you can see, is playing with so much confidence right now. Even Patty Maroon's making beautiful dishes down to Big Moose like this. This is a full team game. It is exactly the kind of game you wanted to see going into a break. Absolutely. So besides the two points, there's a couple impressive numbers to know. Minnesota now has wins in 10 of its last 13 games. Like I said, six straight wins at home. But the Boston Bruins, five or four, excuse me, four straight losses. That's their first four game skid since December of 2019. So big one. Yes, again, for Minnesota, thanks in large part to Marc-Andre Fleury. Career win, 550, now two away from second on the all-time list. After the game, Marcus Foligno spoke with Kevin Gorg after the game-winning goal. Just relaxing. I mean, it's, it's been a grind, not going to lie. So uh, just be with family and friends, and I hope everyone here has a Merry Christmas, and we'll see you guys uh, after Christmas. And we're going to be we're going to be a lot better in the second half, and uh, we're, we're excited to get some rest, like I said, but we're, we're really looking forward to, to picking this thing back up after Christmas. Yeah, so after the three-day holiday break, the Wild returned to action on Wednesday, taking on the Detroit Red Wings. Second meeting of the season. Last time they went head-to-head, -head, it was Dean Evison's last game behind the bench. Very different team this go-around. We'll see what's in store on Wednesday, starting at 6.30 on Wild Live. We look forward to seeing you then. Happy holidays, everyone. Merry Christmas. Enjoy the break. We look forward to seeing you on Wednesday. Until then, for Mark Parrish, I'm Audra Martin. Thanks for joining us tonight on Wild Breakaway, presented by Luther Kia of Bloomington.